Let's talk about that current boogeyman in MMA, Alex Pereira. Man's got Yiri out cool in the second round with a mad head kick, you know, then casually fixes his broken toe like it's nothing, bro. That's some next level bar assery right there. Give this guy a BMF title now, like without even a fight, because he's that guy. Real talk, like Alex, I feel like he's getting into his prime right now. Unbeatable sniper, checks every attack like he's playing the UFC on easy mode. This man got power for days, can't wait. To Israel at the Sunny's reaction to this, probably crying out of hate like I'll be this guy once. Is he right now? Must be like you're taking everything I work for, motherfucker. Like to be honest. But let's quickly break it down. Not like there's a lot to break it down on this fight because Yuri didn't learn jack from his first fight with Alex. Bro, you don't keep your hands low against Pereira. Like those feints and head movement, disaster waiting to happen. I knew a kick was coming before the first round ended. Like it was right there. Cause the brother have this weird thing like he keeps his head down and he's just doing that weird feints bro you're doing too much like you know if you're gonna feint that much and you're gonna do that head movement too much this is not boxing here yeah? like you're gonna get that head kick done and delivered so alex dropped him in the first round with the lead hook and yuri never recovered from that one you know because brother got up all wobbly and shit you know and don't get me wrong that kick was nasty but the damage was already done with the first knockdown and then after the kick yuri took some unnecessary damage Herb Dean doing this old man run. Bro, what's that all about? Like picking him up when he's clearly out of it. That's rule 101 fam. Don't do that, you know. Herb Dean with the famous half stoppage. Dude so goofy, he like comes running in like a newborn giraffe. Like then then... <laughs> Dude so goofy man, like he runs like a newborn giraffe then circles... <laughs> I'm sorry bro, that's just mad luck. Like. That's just mad funny still. Alex stood over Yuri for a solid 2 seconds before going down for the TKO. I still think that's not a TKO man, that's a clear out knockout, brother was out. He thought Yuri was out, but Herb Dean made sure this time that he really never gets up again. All in all, like you know, when you get hit with that left hook, you're not recovering from that at the end of the day. What is next for Alex Pereira? Playing the devil's advocate here? Let him defend it one more time against Ankalaev. If anyone can pose a real challenge, it's Ankalaev with his ground game. But I don't think Dana wants that, you know, he's got a new poster boy and he doesn't want to risk it still. He did say that you want to move on to heavyweight and I'm all for it man, like this guy got the aura to get it done. Can you believe Alex used to fight middleweight, like man such a big boy even for a light heavyweight. Fighting at middleweight was mad still. Imagine if he becomes the first fighter to become 3 three weight champion, absolute beast you know. But yeah let's let's quickly go through some of the the comments uh, online let's what let's see what people been talking about <clears throat> so let's see let's see let's see kazi all right so i thought jury stood a chance give him john jones in december um yeah pff, all right if john jones actually want to fight i don't think so i don't think he want to fight he just want to set into the sunset after his Stipe Miocha fight he's, he's already ditching like, like Tom Aspinall <clears throat> respect to Alex for trying to help Yuri up after the stoppage yeah that, that's true though like I'm not gonna lie that that shows class man and it shows how much he dislike Jamal Hill like you know how he did that that thing not with him he's humble he knows that you know the brother is good Although the, the lead up to the fight was funny, you know, how they were like talking about the spiritual stuff and that. And honestly, like that five minute uh, stare down and they weren't even blinking. It felt like, you know, whoever blinks is a, is a, is a dusty bitch, you know, like that's what happened. They weren't blinking for five minutes. That's crazy, gang. It looked like an anime fight on God. <clears throat> is he punching air in the bar right now? Like, exactly. That's what I was saying as well. And the concern that Poatan had for Yuri after the knockout was impressive. Humility on another level. He is the champion no doubt and yeah like my brother was actually worried about him like he was trying to see like if if the geezer all right you know damn you should all appreciate izzy for giving this man the hardest fight ever and even ko him you know what yeah all right i'll give it to him izzy you know like and that cold celebration like bah, bah, bah. yeah like all right you give it to him that was cool but saying that for middleweight he was cutting too much weight as well so like you know he was not as fullest uh, but I'm not gonna take that away from Izzy at the end of the day. The more I see Alex win, the more I understand why Izzy was so hyped after the win over him. Yeah, bro, like, like that was a fluke, man. Ten time out of nine time out of ten, Izzy is dropping dead. That was it, like, bro. So I can see why he was so hyped. But yeah, that's a quick recap about the main event. My next video is going to be about. I'm gonna touch a little bit about everything what happened in the UFC 303. 
There's not a lot to talk about. Uh, however, Talbot, that kid is that kid is mental, bro. Like he's so good. Not gonna lie. So yeah, keep an eye out on him and uh, drop a comment below. Let me know what you you think I should talk about next in my videos. Uh, I feel like YouTube's got me shadow banned, bro. I barely got any impression in my last video. I thought it was pretty bang on, but YouTube, what are you doing, bro? Give me some views, you know. I need that money. I just got like a camera bro I got everything these like look at the backdrop plus he's still like got all these things going on but what how am I gonna make that money back if he's not gonna give me impression bro anyway allow it man if you're seeing this video subscribe to my channel until next time